No, I'm not Satchmo, but we do <laughs> we do collect another piece of history here in our history museum. And these instruments, these saxophones, and some more instruments that I'll show you were Docky Greens. A lot of you remember or know Docky Green from owning Green's Pharmacy. Jeannie Hotman, Hotton, Jeannie Hotton sold me these instruments to put into our Haverty Grace History Museum. But these saxophones here, and there's one more saxophone. I'll show you a picture of all four saxophones. We'll put better pictures on our blog site. But these are all Docky Green's instruments. Another photo that I got in another place, totally different, is the band that he used to play in back in the day. Some of the other instruments, and no, I can't play these. I tried to play a trombone when I was in grade school, but my brother split my lip with a shovel of snow. Some of the other instruments that I got that were dockies is the clarinet. And no, I can't play that neither. And a flute. These were all Docky Green's instruments. We'll have better photos and everything on, online of them. But some of the other musical pieces. Oh, one last thing. And I can play that. It's the maraca. This was also Docky's. <laughs> Docky Green's. But some of the other uh, instruments and bands that was in the city was a, I got a post picture of a postcard here, and this is of the textile band back in the early 1900s, probably late 1800s. It was a textile band postcard. Another band that was in town that we have some information, slight information on, was the Bayside Band. I have better pictures that we'll put online. But the Bayside Band, I have pictures of them when they were on one of the steamers. Like, I don't know if it was the Susquehanna or if it was what, what steamer it was. But we've got pictures of them on that. And then I met a lady that her mother and father have four of the instruments that the Bayside Band used to play. So these are Bayside Band members, but that she doesn't remember... Uh, which gentleman had these instruments. So if anybody has any information or any family member that played an instrument in one of the Bayside bands or no any information on any of the, the bands, please let us know. And we've, you can find more information on our blog at bahookas.net or on our Facebook page at George Bahookas Wagner. Also, um, our website at bahookas.com. And another thing that we will get into as far as music goes is the Haverty Grace merch song. This is the sheet music, and we'll, we'll get further in depth into this at another time when I do information on this particular building. Everybody knows it is the Pickcock building, but L.H. Asherfield wrote the Haverty Grace merch song, and they owned or possibly even built this building in the late 1800s. Thank you very much.